This is a quick overview of the 1978 Roper Made Sears LT836 I'm going to be selling. Unit is 41 years old and it's in overall great shape. Uh, all the tires hold air. The deck is overall solid. The belts are in great shape. The, all the spindles and pulleys move freely. The engine is in good shape. It's got a Tecumseh VM80 8 horsepower engine. Um, it's got the sealed beam front headlights as you can see um, the deck like I said it's an overall solid shape uh, it's got some surface rust there's only one small rod area right here under this um, discharge but that really doesn't affect anything and you can fix that with a little sheet metal other than that uh, it's in decent shape the tires are good years they hold air no problem the seat is in overall good shape it's got a four speed uh, Peerless 700 transmission, so it comes from the, the middle and it runs down by, by chain to this differential down here. It's a model 917-255120, not to be confused confused with AYP. This is a Roper. It's a uh, serial number 0768V13428. Um, everything's here on it. Um, you got your light switch, your typical on-off switch, your throttle cable. Um, everything moves freely, works. Uh, it, it starts, runs, and um, it mows. I don't have a battery in it at the moment, so I'm, I can't start it, but uh, the headlights work. And uh, it's got points and condenser. Air filter's clean. Uh, fresh fuel, fresh oil. It's got a big solenoid. Uh, one thing to note about this unit this unit does not have a um, alternator it has a simple plug-in charger this is that's what it has and I didn't I don't have the charger for it but when you put a battery in you can just charge it after every use with a battery charger it's got the adjustable carburetor all that I'm sure if you wanted to you could find the charger for this or a splice in a, a, a different type of charger and just use a different uh, plug for a AC adapter charger and uh, it originally would have taken a smaller battery. You could get one at Harbor Freight like that, or you could stuff a, a regular tractor battery in there if you wanted to. Um, also, since it was only electric start, but they do have the option, they sell a starter cup that you can bolt on here and wrap a rope around this and pull start it with the rope. And, just, and it'll be a pull start too, so you could do that. So, as you can see, it's an overall nice shape, LT836. It's a VM80 Tecumseh. It has a Sears model number. It's a 143 something. It's up front, and I can't really catch it on camera. Maybe I can. If you can see that, it's hard to see. Now you're not going to be able to see it on, on the... It's a 143. I'll note it in the description. But as you can see, it's an overall nice shape, and... Uh, I'm going to be selling it, probably local pickup. We could arrange shipping via freight if you want to pay for it on a pallet. That's up to you. But uh, yeah, this is a very um, unique 41-year-old Roper made Sears, and it's in very nice shape. Uh, is there anything else to note before I sign off? Not really. Everything, like I said, works on it. Everything's free. The brake works, all that. If I get a chance, I'll show it running, but uh, it starts and runs, and uh, it works off of points and condenser. If you wanted, you can add a Nova 2 electronic ignition to it, and then have elect electric uh, solid-state ignition, if you wanted. All right, so that's it. I'll just show the it from all angles, so you can see. It's nice on both sides. Like I said, the deck, you could sand that down and repaint it, and that'd be good. So, uh, that's the story on this, uh, cool looking machine. All right. Thanks for watching. Take care.